We're told that Daryl spent 24 and one fourth hours writing a chapter of a novel. And then they ask us, what are some things that 24 and one fourth divided by three fourths could represent in this context? So my understanding of this is they really just want us to be a little bit creative about what division by a fraction could represent in a given context. So, well, one, I encourage you to pause your video and think about that a little bit before I think about it. But one thing I think about is, well, if I took 24 and 1 fourth, and if I were to divide it into chunks of 3 fourths of an hour, because this is in hours, how many chunks would I have? So this could represent, let's say that uh, he spent, he spent 45 minutes, which is the same thing as three fourths of an hour, three fourths hours of an hour, I should say, three fourths of an of an hour each day. How many days? How many days did it take him? Did it take? And then you could evaluate this. 24 and 1 fourth divided by 3 fourths. We've talked about how to evaluate that in other videos. So that's one context. Another one could be some type of a, a comparison. So let's say that 24 and 1 fourth is 3 fourths of the amount of time that he spent doing something else. So let's say, so this is now a completely different context. I'm going to put a line here. I'll do it in a different color just to make it clear it's a different context. So another one could be, to justify doing this division, he spent 3 fourths as long writing, writing as he spent illustrating, illustrating the chapter. And so then the question is, how long did he spend illustrating? How long? did he spend illustrating? Now, I really want you to think about this one. My brain actually, this one takes a little bit longer for my brain to, to process. But when you think about it, if you divide by a fraction that is less than one, you're going to get a number larger than the one that you're dealing with. Or another way to think about it, the time spent illustrating, time illustrating, I'll write it like this, the time illustrating, times 3 fourths should be equal to the time spent writing. Because it says he, he spent, or he spent, I forgot to write that, he spent 3 fourths as long writing as he spent illustrating. So time illustrating times 3 fourths should be time writing, or 24 and 1 fourth. So if something times 3 fourths is equal to 24 and 1 fourth, then 24 and 1 fourth divided by 3 fourths should be equal to time time illustrating. So these are the two contexts that I can think of that might make sense, but you might be able to think of others.